The Esperanto Teacher Section 49 Words Used with the Object This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For further information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. The Esperanto Teacher A Simple Course for Non-Grammarians by Helen Fryer Words Used with the Object As already said, when an adjective or participle or a noun is added to the object simply as a describing word, it takes n like the object, as li perdis sian novan libron, au sian libron novan, he lost his new book. Si tranquilligis la criegantan infanon, au la infanon criegantan, she pacified the screaming child. Li visitis sian fraton Johannon. He visited his brother John. John shows which brother. But if the adjective, participle or noun is used not merely to describe, but indirectly to tell something about the object, it does not take n. A comparison of the following sentences will make this clear. 1. Li trovis la pomoin maturain. He found the ripe apples. Li trovis la pomoin maturai. He found that the apples were ripe. 2. Li trovis la crucion rompitan. He found the broken jug. Li trovis la crucion rompita. He found that the jug was broken. 3. Li colorigis la drapon rujan. He dyed the red cloth. Li colorigis la drapon ruja. He dyed the cloth red. 4. Li tranchis, au faris, la veston tro malongan. He cut or made the too short coat. The coat that was too short. Li tranchis la veston tro malonga. He cut the coat so that it was too short. 5. Li nomis la knabon mensogisto. He called the boy a liar. Compare this use of words with the following. He made his father angry, or be angered. Li colorigis sian patron, or li igis sian patron colera. The loss drove him mad. La perdo frenesigis din, or igis lin freneza. It rendered the gun useless. Gi senutiligis la pafilon, or igis la pafilon senutila. End of lesson. Section 49